Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's wig is from Asteria Hair and I'm working with their 5x5 HD curly wig in the length 24 inches, 180 density. So you guys can see this wig is quite full. I actually brushed out the curls a little bit more just to have this, just to get the hair to look like this. So yeah, if you guys want to see how I installed and styled the wig, then make sure you stay tuned and carry on watching. And I'll catch you guys in my next one. The wig came in this box, as you guys can see. So today I'm working with the 5x5 HD Lace Closure Curly Wig. I've already gone ahead to bleach the knots. It came with a pre plucked hairline. So this is the hair in its natural state. I've already gone ahead to wash and condition the hair, as you can see. So, so I'm just going to go ahead to install this wig now. So I'm going to grab the straps at the back of the wig and I'm just going to clip them together. Like so. So I'm going to clip them together and now the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to apply some foundation onto the lace just to help it, you know, match my skin tone and blend in a bit better. You guys can see even without me gluing the wig down, it fits really secure on my head just because of how I've done the, um, the straps at the back. And now I'm just going to go ahead and pluck the hairline a bit. This lace is so thin, you can barely even see it. Like, I'm just hoping I don't even cut off too much. So I've just plucked the hairline a bit more off camera just to make it look more natural because I felt like it was looking a bit too wiggish. So I'm just going to spray my bed head spray all over the lace and then, you know, pop the wig on my head. Spray it all over the lace. Like so. It's just going to stick onto my head. And then I'm just going to go in with my rat tail comb and just press this into my skin. This is like the easiest way to glue your wig down, like I'm telling you. So now I'm just going to grab some hair mousse and just put this all over the hair. I love this hairbrush because I feel like it just really helps to like define the curls so much. I don't know if you guys can tell. Okay, so I'm just gonna go wait for my hair to dry now and then I'll come back and show you guys the finished look, basically. So this is what the curls are looking like right now. Okay, so this is what the hair looks like once it's dry. The hair feels really, really fluffy. I, st I feel like it's still like slightly damp, but that's fine. And I'm just gonna use my fingers and just brush out the curls just cause I wanna go, I'm going for that really big look today.
Okay, so this is literally what I was waiting for. So I waited for my hair to get dry just so I can have it looking like this. And I feel like this is just, this is a vibe. Like this hair is a vibe. And the hair is so soft as well. Like I can literally run my fingers through the hair. You guys, let me know what you think of this wig and how it looks. The hair is so, this is so nice. This is so nice. Okay, so guys, this is the finished look. And can I just say, I love how this hair is looking right now. Like this big look, this big hair look is definitely a vibe. This is definitely a vibe. Like, and I love how soft the hair is as well. Like it's just so fluffy, as you guys can see, it's so fluffy. So like I said, this wig is from Asteria Hair and this is their five by five HC lace closure wig in the length 24 inches. So it's literally just up to my boobs, as you guys can see. Um, and the density is 180, so it is quite full. I feel like anything more than this is just way too much, but this density is definitely perfect. You can work with it, you can still kind of tame the curls as well. But obviously, I just wanted to go for I just wanted to go for this big look today, and I feel like this is a vibe, like this look right here. This is definitely a vibe. Also, when it comes to the lace, I feel like that's gonna be my new way of gluing down my wigs because it's just so quick and it's so easy. So all I did was I sprayed my bed head spray all over the lace and then I popped my wig on and glued it down. So yeah, you guys, let me know what you think of this wig down below. I absolutely, oh. And the fact that it's a closure as well, like it's just so, e that's the thing. I feel like closure wigs are the way forward from now on. Like, especially if you're a beginner and you wanna obviously get into wearing wigs and stuff, definitely go for a five by five or um, a six by six closure wig. But yeah, so I'm gonna make sure to leave all the links that you guys need to know down below. So please make sure you check the description box and I'll catch you guys in my next one. Bye.